Hey guys, welcome back to another video, guys. Today we're gonna take a look at the brand new S Pen, the S Pen case, all that kind of good stuff. So there is kind of misconfusion, I feel like, for the Galaxy Fold 3. Some people think that there should that there was going to be an S Pen with this Galaxy Fold 3 where it came included, where you got the uh Fold 3 and the S Pen. That is not the case. They are sold separately. Uh, and some people are outraged about that because this phone is of course $1,799 after taxes around $1,800, $1,900, and you do not get the s pen included you have to buy the s pen separately so with the galaxy note series we saw that yes you get the s pen with that galaxy note uh with of course the galaxy s series you do not so even though the latest galaxy s models do support a um s pen uh that is not the case when it comes to getting the device you do not get the s pen you have to buy that separately with the galaxy note series you get it included with the galaxy note Anyway, though, Samsung released today a uh, new thing on the store, and it's right here. So this is a Galaxy Z Fold 3 5G flip cover with S Pen. So yes, you get both a cover, a case, and you get an S Pen for $79.99. So a little bit of, you know, money, obviously, not the cheapest in the world. So if you are going to buy the S Pen plus the Galaxy Fold 3 with this case, you're probably going to be spending around a thousand, uh, $2,000 for the whole entire thing, both S Pen and Galaxy Fold 3. So definitely a chunk of cheddar to say the least. Nonetheless, though, this is a case we have been looking at recently on the channel. So it's nothing new when it comes to what the case looks like. But of course, this is what the S Pen would look like uh, right on the side. It does say Fold Edition because this is the Galaxy Fold 3 S Pen. Which again is why a lot of people thought, wait, doesn't that come with the Galaxy Fold 3? If it's literally meant for the Galaxy Fold 3, nope, you gotta buy that separately. It's $79.99 separately uh, with the case included. So let's take a look at some of these pictures. And again, like I said, this is kind of a weird concept. So how this works is on the left hand side of the phone where the hinge is, is where your S Pen actually is gonna go ahead and show lax and be right there at all times. So whenever you need to, you just go ahead and pull it out and then bam, you have your S Pen on you at all times. Now the front cover, as you guys can see, is literally just a kind of like a dust resistant cover. It goes over the display. And when you want to use it, you just peel back the front cover and you can use the phone without any issue at all. I'm gonna be interested to see, you know, as the time goes on, if this actual cover ends up breaking. So like, for example, you see that left hand side right there. If that actually ends up tearing as people use this every single day because obviously you know at the end of the day yes these are made very well but if you use it every single day every single second eventually i feel like it might actually start end up tearing so that should be interesting to see what ends up happening there nonetheless though this phone is very very cool uh and this s pen just adds a little bit more to it so let's look at some other pictures here um bam so here is what the back looks like in the case we of course have full protection on all sides which i do personally like uh, i feel like in a way it does add even more to the water resistant not too too much but of course if you have a case on the phone even those nook and crannies that get exposed are not being exposed because of the fact there is a case on the phone uh but at the very top here you can see we have the triple camera set up and it looks like there actually is a indent for the camera so meaning that this case actually covers the cameras which is really really cool because again that just adds more protection uh and chance of it breaking is you know less so right here we have it fully open and again we have the s pen right there we have the whole entire display uh, phone right here and then finally we have this right here which you guys can see once you open it up that is of course the whole entire phone and again it does look like on the sides it does go ahead and um it looks like there is it uh, cut out for the power button in the volume rocker it doesn't based on this angle look like it's covering them at all which is really good because of course that means actual full access to both buttons some cases do a really poor job of giving you access to your buttons on your phone i know it's like the simplest thing like oh, why, why would they not give you access because again some cases especially some hard cases which just does look kind of like a hard case at the bottom uh just go ahead and they they when you put them on they just kind of like put little plastic pieces around the buttons which absolutely destroys the purpose of using a phone 
and then finally we have this right here and you guys can, can see the back cover is kind of coming off because of course that is like i said before meant for it when it is of course closed to cover up the display especially if you're in your pocket or something like that not the screen uh tear the screen nonetheless though this screen is a lot more durable than our previous iterations of this phone uh so that's something to take a consideration of when it comes to this phone that's why a lot of people are excited about this phone that it does this you know have s pen support because again it is going to go ahead and give you um What's the card? It is going to give you a lot more support when it comes to the display. So as you guys can see at the very top here, it does go ahead and raise up a little bit. So it does not raise up the whole entire phone. It only raises up on the right-hand side of the phone, so the bottom of the phone. There is going to be a little bit of a divot when it comes to the screen size. So obviously the top will be a little bit smaller than the bottom. Uh, not too big of a deal. Definitely something to take into consideration. Uh, as you guys can see on the bottom here too. So very interesting. But guys, tell me down below your thoughts and opinions. Are you going to pick up the s pen with your galaxy fold 3 or are you gonna say nah i'm not picking the s pen i'm just gonna rock the galaxy fold 3 i'll see you guys in the next one peace out